Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Resident Evil 3 Remake Part 5. Yeah, that's right, Part 5. Last time, we we escaped from the Nemesis of Jill. And let's see here, what else did we do? And we made it to Carlos, but... Mihai... Mihai... Mihao just blew himself up around the nemesis after going in the subway with him and Nikolai. And now, Tyrell, now we get to play as Carlos. And after defeating the zombie Brad, we get his card, and then we enter the Raccoon Police Department. So our main objective is find Dr. Bard by going to the star's office. What the hell was that thing? That's gonna be one of the new enemies that are gonna be very annoying. Couldn't have been a zombie. No, worse than that. Why is there a person on the impaled? Why is a person impaled up there? Close, man. I didn't stick around. No. Great. Annoying zombies over there. Uh, here we go. Shoot to the legs, Carlos. That works for me. He's dead now. Whoa! It's the liquor! They're the ones from Resident Evil 2. I remember these enemies. Oh crap! Now we're gonna run into annoying. Whoa! We're gonna run into more zombies over the legs, Carlos. Oh crap! Get the hell off me, you stupid zombie. Huh. You can actually tackle an enemy? Ah! Fuck off! Come on. Can't even... Melee attack with the RB. You can only dodge. That's for sure. Oh my that zombie. That's just me off. Oh. Right. Big warm RPD welcome. <laughs> wow. What have we here? Flashbang grenades. I remember these from Resident Evil 2. You blind enemies with it. What's this? It's a rifle ammo. T, you Perfect. copy? There's something real nasty in here. I don't know what it is. Something nasty. All right. I'll take a look with the cameras. Watch your six. Okay. <sighs> Open this up, unlock that door, now use your grenade. Kaboom! There's another zombie over there. Get the fuck off me! 
It's not coming. Sorry. We're sorry. Where was I? No. Get away from me. I thought I shot up. I thought I blew you all up. No. I don't even have a choice. Stay out of my way, you zombie okay. pricks. Okay, that's it. I'm gonna be using that flashbang for now. Whoa! Okay, just shoot them in the legs, Carlos. Keep going, Carlos. There's another one that I fought. Why are these zombies so annoying? Dead end. Looks clear to me. West office, safety deposit room. Shit. Fuck. This needs a key. You need a key to unlock that door. Hmm. Let's go to the dark room. Internal memo. September 22, 1998. Office supply internal relocation notice. Keep your system three number combination safe. Move from stars, office two floor to west office one floor. The combo is left nine, right 15, left seven. Please change the combo ASAP upon receipt. Raccoon Police Department Facility Maintenance Department. Oh, cool. Turn the light on. If the cameras killed those things, I'd be set. Yeah. This is the dark room. Like photography. Okay. So rifle ammo. Some herbs. I don't need it right now, but. Hmm. Let's just go to the west office. Shall we? Let's kill that possum playing zombie over there. You have to kill the zombie over there before you proceed. In this area. Okay, let's do that combination. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's it. Seven. That's all. Hip pouch. Carry more items. Perfect. Red herb. Handgun ammo. September 20th arrest report. Ronnie Gray, unemployed, former electrician. Charges, unlawful creation or possessions of explosives. Suspects was behaving suspiciously at 1442 Fox Street on 
September 18, 1998, suspect's person was searched, producing a small explosive at a time detonator from his inside pocket, leading to arrest on the charges listed above. A search of suspect's home found more than 20 additional homemade explosives at various stages of completion. The suspect was extremely agitated and not of sound mind. Suspect spoke feverishly when he questioned again at one point. Questioning had to be halted due to a sudden bout of shrieking from suspect. Once questioning was resumed, suspect made the following statement. I didn't do it for me. I did it for you. Why doesn't anyone understand? Corpses are fact from the shadows. A storm's coming, but, the, but this umbrella is no good. Gotta blow it up or you'll be more than just wet. Gotta get these bombs. Gotta get more bombs. They're coming. Soon. Gotta hurry. Burn up. Burn the corpses. Burn them good. Happened in the Resident Evil 1 remake. Before they turn into crimson heads. Pretty annoying. During questioning, the suspect began to shake violently before resuming a shrieking fit. Questioning was ended and a sedative administered. Due to the suspect's unstable psychiatric condition, suspect's testimony changed from moment to moment. Suspect's delirium made any sort of dialogue impossible. We are currently awaiting the result of a doctor's investigation into suspect's conditions. The explosives collected from suspect's person and residence appear to be extremely powerful. As, as a safety precaution, a battery was removed from one detonation device. Upon its admission into evidence, the battery was secured in the safety deposit room. Interrogating Officer Drucker, West Drucker. What kind of name is that? Okay. Put the ID card in, and we get scope That's for the assault rifle. Haha. -ha. Okay, a 5.56 times 45 millimeter assault rifle optimized by UBCS for its operation. Its short length affords great mobility, even in urban setting. Let's go. Nope, not yet. Oh, the name Jojo. Remind me of Jojo's Bizarre Adventure. Yeah, enough about that. Let's focus, shall we? Wrong way. Carlos. Uh oh. Star's office is up ahead. Copy that. Wow. Why is it blocked? <laughs> Let's go over there. Flash grenade. Green herb. What's this? Note to a friend, Hector, if you're reading this, I'm already dead. If you hear any noises coming from the locker, do not open it, please. While you were out on patrol, I focused on finding a way to get, the, to get to the other side. I realized that explosives might be our best bet. I managed to rig up a pretty good bomb, but we don't have any batteries for the detonator. I'm pretty sure I sent one to the safety deposit room during our in intake last week. We need that battery. If we're going to knock this wall down, so I headed upstairs to find you since I know you have the safety deposit room key. As soon as I left the shower room, I was attacked. One of them bit me. I watched the wound as best as I could, but I feel worse and worse. He's now a zombie. I hope I don't need to spell out why you must not open the locker. Please don't worry about me. Just get yourself out of there as fast as you can, you buddy was. Break the shower room wall. Better not. Yeah. Place the bomb over there to a cracked wall. You gotta find the battery, right? Alright, let's go up there. Let's 
gonna be a possum playing zombie over there. I knew it. Okay, run for it. Shoot to the legs. Ha ha! Works. That works. What are you waiting for, man? Stupid zombies. You infected Brad. That's for Brad. Okay. A key. That could be useful. Oh. At least that's not a zombie. Okay, B. B, C, M. So that we get an assault rifle. Or oh, ammo. That's right. You know what? I should probably reload. Should probably take that herb. Find it and take the herb. Cool. Ah, cool. Very cool. Okay, gotta go downstairs to the first floor. And whoa! What the fuck? Oh crap! These liquors are annoying and fast. They'll scratch you. They're blind. Ah! I should have dodged it. Don't get the fuck off me! Ow! Oh man, I'm in caution right now. Seriously, hate the fucking liquors. You stupid liquors. I hate those guys. They're annoying. Sorry, bad language. Okay. Why are these liquors annoying? Liquors are the ones from Resident Evil 2 and 5. I hate liquors more. Do you? And there's a zombie over there. Take that. Okay. Enter the locker number. There we go. Nope. Oh, never mind. Oh. So right for ammo. The battery. Standard nine volt battery. Grenade. Stay out of trouble. Cool. Come to Papa. You know what? Screw it. I don't need the key. Get the herb. That's not enough. Okay. Gotta find that detonator. Oh crap! Zombie. Stupid zombies. What are you doing? Serves you right, pal. Copy that. Great. 
Air bomb over there. Electronic gadget. Of course. Medium sized electronic gadget. Cool. Find it. Detonator. A detonator for C4 explosives. Okay. Put the detonator over there. And here we go. Boom. Kaboom. And then we got some zombies over there. To annoy you. One, two, three. Take this. Oh, the steam. No use in going back. Zombie. You are getting on my last nerve. One at a time, take a number. One at a time, take a number. Oh crap! Stop all the wasting. Huh. Oh crap. Haha, <laughs> headshot. Roar. Okay. There's the zombies, right? Oh crap. I'm under caution, right? What the crap? Okay. That's a great decision. Saving ammo. First aid spray. Okay. Right. More liquors. Again. Does it work? Did it work? Got blind. Stupid liquors. Haha. -ha. You're dead, stupid liquor. I hate these liquors. They're so annoying. Oh man. You know what? That's better. At least for the time being. Okay. Made it. Of course, made it. What is that? Is that Dr. Bart? Is it a picture of his dog? Dr. Bard. Oh, thank God. Do you know how long I've been trying to reach somebody? Don't worry, we're gonna get you out of there. Just tell me where you are. I'm trapped in a goddamn hospital, surrounded by every kind of abomination. Wow. Look, just send in stars. They're gonna know what to do. No, negative. RPD's overrun too. Then figure it out. Umbrella's gone crazy. They're killing all the researchers. That's a lot of researchers. I am the only one who knows how to make the vaccine to stop the zombies. So you can either sit there with your dick in your hand or send, send somebody who's capable of getting me the hell out of here. <sighs> really? I like him already. Oh, you are out. You heard what he said. We can't turn him over to the company. Nope. It's not our call to make. That's Mihail's call. Mihail. Check the computer, see if I can trace the doc's location. Mihail just blow himself up. Is it to save Jill? This will take Look, some time. Guitar. Look around, see if you can find anything useful. 
flashbang grenades. Okay. The garden. Ammo. Assault rifle ammo. Awesome. Uh, near my dad. Report on the mansion incident. The bizarre incident occurred in a mansion owned by the Umbrella Corporation located in the Arclay Mountains. On July 23rd, Star's Bravo team was dispatched to the Arclay Mountains to investigate a series of mysterious and grisly murders. It went unexpectedly radio silent. On July 24, Alpha team was dispatched as well and became entangled in the events as well at the and became entangled in the events at the nearby mansion. The incident com uh, sorry. Cum uh, sorry. Cum uh, accumulated in the destruction of the mansion. <laughs> Casualties were numerous. Sorry about that. Casualties were numerous. The only survivors were five members of STARS, including Rebecca, Wesker, Jill, Barry, and Enri Enrico, or Brad. But Enrico was shot by Wesker in the first Resident Evil game. Kind of messed up. The cause of the incident was the illegal bioweapon experiments carried out, out in a secret umbrella lab beneath the mansion. The T virus being used in these experiments escaped the facility and is presumed to be the root cause of all that occurred. However, all evidence was destroyed along the mansion, along with the mansion, so further investigation has proven to be extremely difficult. Oh, man. Is that saying? Jill in the front row? That's Jill in the front row. Yes. Is that Chris? And there's Wesker, the one with the shades. Albert Wesker, that bad guy from the from the first Resident Evil. What a traitor Wesker is. And there's a red herb. Any more stuff to collect? Uh, I have no use for that. Of course not. Well, that's all I can collect. Now to go to the door. Yeah, what's up? Derailed. Was anyone hurt? Jill? Uh, shit's what? right. Jill, Jill, what happened? Sorry about that. Jill, come in. See, I gotta go. Do what you gotta. Where I'll you gotta go? Find Jill. Go take care of Bard. 4:43 a.m. Star's office. Several minutes earlier, subway tunnels. Oh man, Jill just survived the explosion. It's a lot of flames. Find a way above ground. Am I the only one who made it? No. Yes. You're the only one who made it, Jill. You're the only one. Okay, we gotta open that, that door with the wheel on it. Let me enter in this safe room. The, that shelter. Yeah, she's out of range. Get some mine rounds. UBCS, new weaponry notice. We got some new weaponry for you that's guaranteed to put brass in your in your socks. They call it mine rounds. These babies were developed by Umbrella's military R&D, and they will light your fires even hotter than the lever you left back home. 
They're tough to find and tricky to handle, but trust me, they're worth it. All right, let's take a look at the specs. Mine rounds are designed for steady issues. Grenade launchers. Don't get cute and try to lure them in anything else. Fire at the walls or the ground and they'll stay right where you put them. Sensors in the mine will detect approaching enemies and detonate when they get within range. So basically, just toss them in an enemy path and you got yourself a landmine. There's no such thing as unfair when you've taken on those giant freaks. So get out there and fight dirty. Mine rounds. Ammo for a grenade launcher. Flies to its target using its own propulsion system. Detonates after a short period of time if, or if approached. Okay. Okay. More of these. <sighs> okay. Okay. By the way, probably put the eight, sp eight spray in there. Let's just hold on to the eight spray just in case, shall we? Let's stay out of trouble. I'm going to stay out of trouble and do the right thing. Right, what I always do. That's what I have to do. Okay. I'm going to be finding the nemesis. Oh man, that's a lot of zombies. See if I can... See if I can test this out. Landmine. Oh great. When it turns red, they explode. Cool. Maybe best to save those ammo. Maybe best to save some ammo. Whoa, there's another one of these. Die, you punk ass zombies. Serves them right. Okay. We're still alive. I can't stay here. Oh. Escape the creature. Are there any items to collect? this brochure St. Michael's Clock Tower. St. Michael's Clock Tower is a Baroque style old building which stands at the heart of Raccoon City. It has become a beloved icon and residents consider it to be emblematic of the city as a whole. St. Michael's Church erected this tower in 1908 with the assistance of several philanthropists. It was dedicated to the children born in the developing city. And the first floor was used as an elementary school for many years. The city saw further growth during its electrification over the course of the early 20th century, and the students' body of St. Michael's Elementary swelled to over 600 students. Unfortunately, St. Michael's Elementary was shuttered in 1978 as the building began to show signs of age and wear. The clock was deactivated, and strict limitations were placed on entry to the surrounding premises. Years passed with once beloved monuments and public plaza locked down during the 1900s, 1990s, that is. The Umbrella Corporation worked in league with Mayor Michael Warren to renovate the area. 
the time the clock tower was all officially reopened in 1993, and today the sound of its heavy tolling bells can once again be heard throughout Raccoon City. Cool. Right. Okay. Refill. Reload, please. Da -da -da. Whoa. The nemesis is on fire. He just fell in the water? I wonder what he's gonna do. I know, right. Carlos, respond. Hey, Wait, Carlos. The train derailed. Derailed? Was anyone hurt? No, everybody's dead. Mihail, everybody. Oh, yeah. The one I was talking about. The, the nemesis shot the, the survivors. No wonder why Nikolai left Jill Wait. to die. What the fuck? What the fuck? Oh! He is Jill, what happened? He just transformed. Okay, stay here too long, you can die instantly. Better make a run for it, because if you don't, instant death. Run for it, Jill. Oh man, he looks like a like a sea creature version of the nemesis. God, here it comes. A boss battle. Roar! Come on! And this battle is gonna be freaking annoying. It's gonna lunge at you. It's gonna use his claw to attack you. And he's gonna... He's gonna jump on top of the clock tower. And then... Slam attack you. Do some shock, shall we? Oh crap! Watch out for his his strike attack, Jill. Oh my God! Don't let his claw, claw hit you. Oh, look, north to the Arclay Mountain. I remember that when you. Oh man, he's coming at me. Uh oh, he's gonna go up there. Hey, look, an ice cream truck. Back. Okay, get the red herb. Handgun ammo. Oh lord. Flame round. Perfect. He's over there. He's going to be climbing all over the place. Walls, buses, buildings, everything. All right. Whoa. Okay. You got to find his weakness. The parasite is his weakness. Best advice to shoot it. Yo. Come on, keep shooting it, Jill. Doing good. Oh, great. Oh, right. More iron. Right. Fuck off. It hurts. Amy Pop. Whoa. Okay. More bullets. And gun ammo, shotgun shells. Okay. So I'll use my shotgun. Where are you? Oh, 
Oh man. So annoying. Oh crap. bullets to find. You can only carry two 20 shotgun shells. Don't get close. No, no, no. Don't you dare scratch me, nemesis. I still need to find some more. Okay, once I defeat the nemesis, I'll stop. What is the point? Come on. Come on, hurry, Joe. No items there? Get out of my way. That hurt. Yeah, very hard to hit while you move. I've got to come up with something fast. Where are the remaining items? You know what? Ah, forget it. Let's just deal with him anyway. Go away! Go! Away! I better wait and maybe... And I think him doesn't really help. Go away! You're starting to get on my nerves. Get away from me! Well, you're starting to get on my nerves, pal. Let's just fight him anyway. There's no point in getting all the items. Switch to it! Oh. Alright. I, I agree. Ha! Yeah. Shoot that parasite, Joe. Yeah. All right, let's do this. Suck it. <laughs> Boom. Wow. Is he dead? <laughs> oh, meaning item was there. I don't care. If 
fair enough. Let's go. Oh, crap. Whoa. Of course, closing the gate really does help by chopping off the nemesis's arm. He regenerates. And he... Oh, my God. God, he just infected Jill on her arm. Ouch. Nikolai. Interesting. You've done me a big favor, Mr. Nikolai. This guy is evil. Holy shit, she's infected. Sorry, pardon my language. Roughly a half day later. Only half a day later. Dawn. Jill. Carlos. Hey, answer me. He just she coughed up blood. Tyrell, oh, do you she's, copy? She's infected. What's going on? Jill's been infected. I I'm taking her to the hospital. Maybe Dr. Bard can save her. All right, I'll meet you there. Good point, Carlos. But who in the world would infect Jill? You hang in there, Super Cop. I got you. The hospital. When you see this, oh, there's a magnifying glass picture over there. September 29, 9.20 p.m., Spencer Memorial Hospital. Fight it, Jill. I'm gonna get you the vaccine. Yeah, that vaccine. You're gonna be okay. Gotta search for a vaccine. We're gonna be searching for a vaccine. But for now, we'll have to stop. Okay, everybody, this is Gabriel Gaming 5000 k I will be signing off. And I'll see you next time, guys. Ta-ta for now.